For the past 56 years, the ATC has been a place for hands-on learning for students who wanted a different choice, a different pathway for learning, for technical training. What we do here is so different than the normal school environment. It's actual hands-on. The students actually can relate science, reading, writing, math to what they're doing in the shop. And they kind of see the value of it because a lot of students will be like, well, I'm not good at math. But then they get in here and they realize, wow, I need to know how to do this math in order to do an alignment. A lot of times we put ourselves in the box in the education world and we forgot that there's a whole other real world out there that's getting their hands dirty. I think recognizing that we bring something to society that you don't necessarily get from a textbook. My time at the ATC for the past two years, it's been great. Um, I have a great teacher, Mr. McClure, he's helped me a lot along the way um, to grow and get better in the construction industry with like um, all kinds of different woodworking and stuff that I would never have known if I didn't take this class. So definitely love the ATC. I recommend that all kinds of people go there. Like, if you can get in, take it, because it's, it's very well worth your time. As soon as COVID started, I had nothing. I was failing my classes and everything. I got sent to the academy, and then they told me that I can take an ATC class. So I chose welding, and that turned my whole life around. The ATC helps a lot with students that want to actually be in the workforce right up, right after high school. There's nothing more satisfying than fixing that car, you know, from a lot of my students. By accomplishing that one task, they feel like they conquered the world. So when we think about the UP Center, there's really three priorities. The first being adult education and training, community health services and well-being, and then technical training and education for students as young as kindergarten all the way through 12th grade. So with that, we're going to be kind of transforming from a school to a community hub where we can reach our youngest learners all the way through adulthood who are looking to find opportunities to grow and expand and find new possibilities. We are limited within these four walls, but when we partner with those out in the field, that's where the magic happens. That's where the opportunities come. That's where the experiences come. We value partnerships because that's what strengthens this place, and that's what's gonna strengthen your place. The UP Foundation and the vision for the new UP Center, um, it's a game changer for all of Nelson County, all local employers. Um, the opportunities that it will provide for not only students, but our community as a whole. We wouldn't not be involved um, on behalf of MAGO. Times have changed, and these kids are growing up a lot faster than we did, and more is probably expected of them at an early age than was expected of us. So I think uh, as employers, we just have to realize that, and we have to help any way we can, small way, big way, whatever, but we have to help out. The talent that our high school students have now is amazing and I'm seeing it in the private sector as well as the public sector and we need to take advantage of that and it's great that Nelson County School System is uh, going in that direction really on a large scale now. They've been doing it for a number of years but now I think they're going to knock it out of the park. Um. If there's something that I want to add to the ATC that I think would be valuable is definitely a heavy machinery operations because I know for people like me who've gone through and had these experiences, not very many people get those experiences. So I think opening the doors for that experience to come through the ATC would be awesome. So what excites me most about the UP Center is just the expansion of opportunities for students. We talk a lot about wanting to give students more opportunities, but when you think about this place, right now we're very limited in what we can bring with the number of classrooms we have, the number of community spaces. With the addition of heavy equipment, with diesel mechanics, with this community space, we're going to be able to reach a larger range of students as well as adults who really want to grow and want to expand their horizons and find purpose in this. Along with that comes partnerships that are going to be natural to help create the pipeline for industry and strengthen our workforce for our regions. Bottom line is we can't develop next generation's workforce without partnerships, so we need you.